10 Shocking Foods You'll Never Buy Again After Knowing How They're Made What factors do you consider when buying food? Most of us listen to our taste buds and hardly think about going deeper into how the food is made and have a sort of blind faith that what we are eating is perfectly normal and appetizing. Sorry folks, sometimes that's just wrong. So here's some information that may change your perspective about your favorite food. We hope you're not eating any of these products while watching this video because you probably never want to buy them again. In today's video, we will share with you the 10 shocking foods you'll never buy again after knowing how they're made. Number 1. Margarine On every margarine package, you can read how it is a cholesterol-free and healthy alternative to butter. It might contain no cholesterol, but it has tons of damaging trans fats formed during the process of hydrogenation. It is considered the worst type of fat to eat as it increases LDL cholesterol, also known as bad cholesterol, lowers the level of HDL or good cholesterol, and is linked to cardiovascular problems, diabetes, infertility, and elevated inflammation. As margarine is derived from heavily processed vegetable oil, there are no vitamins or minerals, but what you can find is hexane, bleaches, and deodorizers, which are used to remove bad colors, flavors, and smells. If you want to consume healthy fats, stick with omega-3 fatty acids and stay far away from trans fat. Number 2. Instant Tea No doubt instant tea is convenient. It takes away the pain of brewing tea for 5-10 to 10 minutes. All you need to do is pour some warm liquid and voila, the tea is ready. But is it good for your health too? It goes through a lot of processing, which lowers its antioxidant properties and makes it devoid of healthy polyphenols. So what are you getting? According to School of Medicine researchers, instant tea mixes have dangerously high levels of fluoride that causes pain and damage to bones and joints. It also contains lots of additives, artificial sweeteners, dyes, and preservatives, which harm your health in many ways. Number 3. Packaged Bread What is in your bread? Flour, water, salt, and yeast, yes, you're right, but that's not all. It also contains the amino acid L-cysteine, which is used to prolong the shelf life of commercial bread. While some L-cysteine is synthesized in the laboratories, most of it is extracted from a cheaper and natural source, which is human hair. The hair is dissolved in the acid and L-cysteine is isolated by a chemical process, which is then packed and shipped to commercial bread producers. And most of the hair is gathered from the floors of hair salons in China. So be sure to read the ingredients list the next time you shop. You can avoid L-cysteine by buying a freshly baked loaf from a local bakery. Number 4. Anything unusually red Do you know what makes a great food coloring? Bugs! One of the most popular is cochineal, a red color additive. It is made from the insect cochineal scale. The insects are collected and quickly killed in hot water, and then dried and crushed to get natural red pigment, or bug juice, which is then used to provide color to sausage, pink pastries, and other vibrant red color foods. It goes by the name carmine, carminic acid, or natural red 4 on the food label. So do not forget to read the label, especially if you are vegan, eat kosher food, or are allergic to carmine. Number 5. Ice Cream what is your favorite ice cream flavor? Vanilla? Raspberry or strawberry? Well, if you enjoy eating any of these flavors, I have some bad news for you. There is a chance you may be eating beaver, anal, and urine secretions. Most ice cream brands use castoreum, which comes from the castor sacs of male and female beavers and is used to enhance the scent and flavor of ice creams. Though some flavor-creating alternatives are also used, you never know as castoreum is FDA-approved food additive and goes by the name natural flavoring in the ingredients list. We've made it halfway through our list, and we sincerely hope you've enjoyed it so far. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Hit the like button and ring the notification bell if you want to see more content like this. Let's move forward with the video. Number 6. Microwave Popcorn Microwave popcorn is the first choice when you are looking for a crunchy, satisfying movie night treat. Though popcorn itself is a whole grain full of fiber and low in calories and fat, in microwave popcorn there are some extra ingredients that you should know. Firstly, it is full of saturated fats, which increase your bad cholesterol and put you at the risk of heart disease. 
and they're also full of salt, approximately 300 milligrams of sodium per serving, which is 20% of your recommended intake. Furthermore, bags of microwave popcorn used to have PFAS, polyfluoroalkyl substances, which is linked with cancer. Now most manufacturers have stopped using harmful PFAS, but plenty of other PFAS substitutes are being used. And according to a 2020 study, microwave popcorn bags always have some amount of PFAS, and those who regularly consume it have higher serum levels of these compounds. Number seven, instant noodles. The best thing since sliced bread is instant noodles. They're tasty, quick, and one of the most consumed processed foods on the planet. But what we do not realize is these cheap noodles that we slurp on are bad for our health. They're loaded with sodium, with one package containing about 1,760 milligrams of sodium, which is 88% of the recommended amount by WHO. And like many other processed foods, it has flavor enhancers and preservatives, like tertiary butyl hydroquinone, TBHQ, which is considered safe in small doses. The chronic exposure leads to neurological damage, liver enlargement, and increased risk of lymphoma. Number eight, hot dog. The next time you are at a baseball game or a cookout, you may be craving one of those big tasty hot dogs, but hearing how they are made may make you think twice about ordering one. Although they are made of meat, they are low in protein, which is a nutrient you want to be getting out of your meat products whenever you eat them. And despite this, they are super high in sodium and most hot dogs are made of scraps of meat that have been blended in a mixture known as pink slime, so you can never be sure which part of the animal you are eating. Number nine, chewing gum. There is a special ingredient in chewing gum known as linolin. It is the component of the gum base and gives the chewable characteristic to the gum. Now let's talk about the source of linolin, which is sheep. Yes, it is produced from the sebaceous gland of sheepskin, which is then extracted by washing the wool in the water and boiling it, removing the water while leaving the linolin. Some other ingredients are glycerin, vegetable oil, sugar, and artificial sweeteners, none of which is good for your health. Number 10, energy drinks. In the year 2011 in the US, more than 20,000 emergency room visits were associated with energy drink use. They are loaded with caffeine, which makes you alert, but when consumed in large quantities, it can increase the blood pressure and makes you susceptible to heart diseases. Plus, to mask the bitterness of caffeine, artificial ingredients and gobs of sugar and salt are added. According to the National Institutes of Health, energy drink consumption is responsible for sleep disorders, cardiovascular issues, and other mental health illnesses in young people. If you want to increase your energy and concentration, move to healthy alternatives like grabbing a piece of dark chocolate, a snack with protein and carbohydrates, and regular exercise. Apologies for spoiling your favorite things on the list, but better safe than sorry, right? Try to avoid these foods and replace them with clean, home-cooked foods and snacks. Preparing food yourself may take a little time and energy, but at least you will know what is on your plate. And still, if you find it hard to resist these foods, eat them in moderation and gradually decrease their amount and soon you will be able to control your cravings. Do you find this video informative or helpful? Let us know in the comments section below. Make sure to subscribe so you don't miss out on my future videos. Don't forget to like and share. Stay healthy!